Well, hey guys, uh, welcome to Daily Bits. Glad you're here. Glad you're here. So I, I, I saw that they was having a Star Wars celebration. Now, this is nerdy. This is nerdy. My nerdy thing. Uh, they announced all kinds of Star Wars projects. Uh, they showed off the trailer for Ahsoka. They talked about the Acolytes and uh, these new Star Wars movies is f featuring Daisy Ridley. Then they have some big crossover event movie and uh, all kinds of cool stuff. Uh, but they shown off the new Indiana Jones trailer. Again, guys, this is nerdy. I'm sorry. I, I have to I have to be nerdy. Uh, they shown off the new trailer for Indiana Jones. Uh, I think it's called The Dial of Destiny or something like that. Um, I, I don't know. I, I You know, I was kind of worried about this movie. I still kind of am. Now, I, my, favorite, my favorite Indiana Jones movie it's definitely Raiders and Last Crusade. Uh, I'm not the biggest fan, but you know it's grown on me uh, of Temple of Doom. A lot of people say that Temple of Doom's the best Indiana Jones movie. I disagree. I disagree, but you know I had my reasons. Mainly, the uh, one of the characters just annoying the shit out of me. She's like the Jar Jar Binks of Indiana Jones. Um, but no, no, I mean, it's grown on me quite a bit. Uh, but I also actually liked Kingdom of the Crystal Skull. Uh, yeah, it was corny, it's cheesy, some of the effects were kind of meh. But it was, you know, it was an Indiana Jones movie, it was just different. Plus, I love Aliens, so it's a, that's the thing, I love Aliens. So that's one of the reasons I really liked it. Uh, I remember going to the theaters to go see Kingdom of the Crystal Skull and... Um, you know, a lot of people walked out. A lot of people were happy about it. Some people disagreed with it. And, you know, I was on the fence, and I watched it again. I was like, eh, it's not bad. It's not a bad movie. Uh, but they're showing off the new Indiana Jones. And Harrison Ford, man, he's, he's getting up there in age. He's getting up there. I didn't think he'd be able to pull off another Indiana Jones movie. I don't think there'll be another Harrison Ford Indiana Jones movie unless... Unless they go the CGI route, which they're doing in this movie. They're making a young Indiana Jones, like flashbacks. Uh, they're doing a CGI thing, kind of like they did with Princess Leia on Rogue One. Uh, or was it Tarkin? Tarkin, too. He, you know, if, I don't know, I don't know if Harrison Ford will allow that to happen. I, maybe, maybe he signed some kind of pact with Disney and, you know, <laughs> it's just it's just wild to think about what they're going to do uh, from here on out. But you know, I, I'm pretty excited for the new Indiana Jones. I think it looks pretty good. Um, I'll probably go see it in theaters. Uh, kind of excited to see what they do with Star Wars from here on out. Now, I'm not the biggest fan of Disney Star Wars. Um, you know, I like Disney Star Wars. Don't get me wrong, there's some of it I like, but there's some of it that's just like, okay, okay, I see what you're trying to do. You're trying to pander to the modern audience, which usually whenever they say the modern audience, it's just, it's just crazy. Like, you know what to expect. You know they're going to have some kind of crazy fake diversity or something like that that's just artificial, just to add it in there. Because that's kind of what Disney's been doing. They've just been kind of making these movies to pander to a, a crowd of people that's not going to watch the movies anyways. They just want something to bitch about. But I, I, I'm, I'm hoping that they kind of change change it a little bit. That way, you know, I can still enjoy them. You know, a lot of people hate The Last Jedi. A lot of people hate it. Um, you know, I'm probably one of the... one only people that actually liked The Last Jedi. Um, it didn't bother me. I mean, there's, sure, there was some stupid shit in it, like the uh, Mary Poppins Princess Leia thing and, uh, you know, the, the, the Holdo thing. Well, well, Holdo, like, that character did something I thought was cool. A lot of people thought it was stupid. Um, there was a lot of, like, girl boss stuff, which, you know, it is what it is. Like, but... They just kind of made, like, any male character seem like they're fucking idiots and stupid and worthless. It's like, okay, that's, that's dumb. 
But I don't know. I don't know. I, I still like The Last Jedi. I think it's an okay movie. Um, I think I think the last Star Wars movie kind of stinks. Uh, what was it? Rise of the Jedi, maybe? I think that's what it's called. I don't know. I, I forgot. I mean, it's watchable. It's not unwatchable. It's just kind of like, you know, you could have done better. You kind of got fucked from The Last Jedi. I think The Last Jedi just kind of fucked everything. Um, and J.J. Abrams had to go in and be like, oh, let's, uh, let's fix this. <laughs> well, we can't, uh, instead of, like, retconning, like, some of the stuff in The Last Jedi, they just had to go with it. Um, so it was kind of hard, I guess it was kind of hard, I kind of wish they would just do some kind of director's cut to the final movie. But it's kind of exciting to see what happens with Star Wars going forward. I, I, I'm still, I, I still have to catch up. I haven't watched, uh, you know, the new season of Mandalorian. I haven't watched um, the last show, Andor, which Andor is based on Rogue One, which is Rogue One is my favorite Disney Star Wars movie. It's That's the best one. That's the best Star Wars movie that's come out in years. Uh, but I don't think we'll see another one of those. But a lot of people say that uh, Andor is really good. Uh, a lot of people are kind of pissed off at The Mandalorian right now. Um, i seen the pictures where uh, Jack Black and Lizzo's in it, which I, I don't know why. I guess they're just cameos, but uh, I don't know. I don't know. They made a big deal about it in on headlines, like in some of these uh, super woke sites, but we'll see. I'm going to watch it, try to get caught up with it, and see how things go, but I don't know if you guys are excited about Star Wars or Indiana Jones, or if you guys even care about that kind of stuff, but uh, it's something I, you know, have grown up watching or playing or reading for, you know, years. It's always been something I thought was cool, uh, but anyways... Guys, thank you so much for watching. Definitely appreciate it. I'll see you soon.